What's up, everybody? Michael Pinnell back, and we're here at Pinboys at the Beach for another episode of Bowling Science. I want to make sure to welcome you guys and thank everybody. I know it's been a difficult month. Um, a lot of things have happened, and with the passing of my father, we have turned our attention towards uh, remembering and celebrating a little bit. Today, we're going to be throwing and discussing the AMF Sumo, which was a urethane ball that he developed for AMF. It was one of his first bowling balls, and it was one of the first balls that he said, quote, flared on purpose. Um, I've been wanting to add a true Mo urethane ball to my bag for quite a while. So we're gonna test this out today, see how it goes. I'm gonna go warm up and we're gonna do three games here. I do wanna point your attention to, as always, bowling.science, the website where you can find our merch and that supports the channel. But on the Bowling Science site launching today, we will have a new tab on the site called Team Mo. The Team Mo tab is going to have jerseys and t-shirts to benefit the Mo Pinnell Memorial Scholarship Fund through Bowl for Life. So uh, I know they've raised a lot of money so far and it's something that we're doing in honor of dad. And I think it's something he definitely want us all to participate in. So if you want to support the Mo Pinnell Team Mo Scholarship with Bowl for Life, you can go to Bowl for Life. I'll put a link in the description. You can donate directly there and just put for Mo or Mo Pinnell in the description. Um, and that money will go towards the Mo Pinnell Memorial Scholarship, but also we'll have the new shirts and jerseys and masks available through Cool Wick um, on the bowling.science site. And I'll have a link for that as well below. If you guys want to check that out, support an awesome cause. I really do appreciate it. Um, on that note, let's uh, check out this amazing AMF Sumo and see what we can do with it on the lanes here in 2021. I encourage all of you to like and subscribe if you haven't already, hit that little thumbs up button. And if you hit the notification bell to let you know every time we bring a new uh, new video up here on Bowling Science. Sorry, my mask giving me a little bit of, <laughs> a little bit of a hard time, but we're gonna keep it up for y'all today. I hope y'all enjoy. Let's get warmed up and see what happens out here on the lanes. This thing hooks. I wasn't expecting all of that. Got my favorite layout on here, four by five by two. It is my favorite, it's four by five by two up. My favorite layout for weaker equipment. I put it on urethane bowling balls and low diff bowling balls as well. Got that one a little outside, it's still recovered really well. Thing absolutely crushes. This is the uh, only ball I brought in with me today. But I'm, I mean, we're getting easy three, two, three inches of flare. I almost wish I brought my U Motion. I'm thinking this thing's hooking almost as much. Maybe four boards left. Maybe. Maybe not even. This thing's nasty. I didn't bring a spare ball in either. So we'll see if we can make spares with it today too.
really impressed with how well this uh, sumo is rolling. I didn't expect this much hook and I didn't expect it to be this close to modern urethane. It's really rolling well. Thank you. 